Good morning, everyone. I hope everyone is doing well. Yes, my hair is shorter, but it is not fixed any better because I have done nothing to it since I got it cut. I've been out in the rain. I've been cutting limbs for the, the goats. <sighs> I got a lot to do. But today I want to talk about some really good clearance. I'm going to talk about the Kroger ad that starts tomorrow. I want to talk about some Dollar Tree things that I think I need to say. Okay, so first things first, I tried to get onto my Kroger page on my computer, but it is not taking my information and it wants to do the shipping to Nebraska for some reason. I don't even do, I, I don't even do business on my computer, so I don't know how to change that around to my normal account where I go in store, blah, blah, blah. But it's saying that I want to ship all of my purchases to Nebraska. I have no idea why it's doing that. I am going to figure it out though. So anyway, I got on the tablet, which I am filming from right now and got onto my Kroger ad. And of course, you know, I'm scrunched down. I'm trying to see stuff. So I really didn't get a very good look at it. Um, however, I do have some of the best pantry finds for this week that I thought were good. Okay, first things first, let's talk about um, just the sale deals. We are doing the buy six or more, save 50 cents an item. So we do know that the Progresso Soup is $1.49, not all of them, but some of them. $1.49 is not a bad a bad price for Progresso soup. What I didn't mention last week was that Denty Moore and Hormel Chili are also on that sale and they're $1.79 a can, which is not a bad deal. These are the times where I used to have coupons and now I don't where I could get them for, I don't know, like a dollar a can. However, if you say, well, I can get it for a dollar 25 at Dollar Tree, let me tell you, Look at your ounces. It's going to be different, possibly. So when you're looking at um, name brand products at Dollar Tree, you're going to find smaller ounces for that $1.25 price in most cases. Okay, now let's go look at the chicken thighs and drumsticks are going to be $1.29 a pound this week. That's a good price. Not the best, but it is a decent price. I will be getting some thighs. If you needed boneless chicken, skinless, skinless, boneless chicken breast, the, today would be the last day at Kroger. You could get them for $1.99 a pound, which is a buy price. Okay. Um, handy foil pans. Some are going to be, they're going to be um, tagged to where you can see which ones, if you buy two, you get one free. I think that's a good deal with some of the stuff coming up. It's not as good as when they were $1.99 or $2.99, possibly. So look at your handy foil packs. I mean, we're getting ready to come into just baking and taking things to other places or breaking down your turkey meals what a great thing to have in your stockpile pantry. Okay. Um, your Pepsi and Coke products are going to be buy two, get two free, which means if you buy two 12 packs, you're going to get two 12 packs for free. It's not a bad deal. Um, the one deal that I don't think is very good is the butter. They're the two one pound packages, which would be eight sticks for $5.99. Um, they're normally $6.99, so they did drop at a dollar, but it still makes it over $2.80 a pound, which we were getting it for $1.99 a pound, what, two, three weeks ago? That's why you jump on those deals, even if you don't need it. If you don't need it three weeks from now, okay, but in three weeks, the price has gone up amazingly, and here you are with no butter and you have to pay more. No big deal, right? Okay, so let's look at the weekly, let's talk about the weekly digitals. 
Okay, Kroger will have their half gallons of milk for $1.29. JC will have their half gallons of milks for 99 cents. Normally, I would go and get five from JC and get five from Kroger because it allows me to do so and cross, I say cross pollinate my, um, yeah, my card. So anyway, with the $1.29 price at Kroger, it's three cents more a gallon than Aldi this week. So Aldi is your best price this week for a gallon of milk, except for if you do JC, which it would make it $1.98 a gallon. So I will still be doing Kroger and JC on my milk just because three cents is not going to jar me to the point where I'm not going to get my fuel points. So there you go. Um, and by the way, milk does freeze. That's why you have those little indents. Um, of course, when you unthaw it, it's going to be broken up and you'll have to work with it a little bit, but it freezes fine. Okay. Another, another one are the Quaker Chewy granola bars or Ch Quaker Chewy bars. Now we buy stuff like this instead of candy. Now I used to do tons of candy deals. Like if you go back into my videos, you can see where I got like $200 worth of candy for like 35 bucks. I mean, I was doing like Easter, Christmas after those when the clearance down, use my coupons, double up 50% off Kroger. And man, I was bringing home shopping carts full of candy. Well, I have stopped that. I have stopped that. So now like Quaker Chewy granola bars are something that we would use here as adults as candy. We're growing up here. But anyway, looking in my digitals, I think I found a dollar off of two and maybe a 50 off of two. So that would make me buy four, but that would still save me a dollar 50, which would make more than one of them off. So there you go. Another weekly digital that I was really shocked to see was the Instapots. Instapots on this digital will be $59.99. That's not a bad price. I think it's $30 off. Okay. Now it's 20 or 30. I can't remember. Um, so I am going to get a new one for me. I'm going to pass on my old one. I'm going to clean it up, pass it off and give it to the neighbor for their kitchen um, they really don't have a setup yet, so I will be buying an Instapot this week. Um, it won't hurt me to have a new one, but the last time that I bought my, when I bought my Instapot, I got two of them for the price of one with the digital coupons, the sale, the promotional deal, and I bought myself one and I bought my daughter one. So it was great. You know, I got two for the price of one. She got one. I got one. And you know, what a great asset to a kitchen, you know, when you've got that roast and you just, just don't have time to mess with it so much easier. Um, I don't like the cleanup on the Instapots, especially when you're doing foamy things like seafood. Um, seafood is really bad. I mean, it cooks it perfectly. Like it will steam lobsters like no other, um, frozen shrimp, all of that, but it makes such a foamy, I think it's part of the shell and all of that, um, that it's really hard to clean. But anyway, I'm going to get an Instapot and on this digital, you could get up to five. Say you wanted to pay or spend 60 bucks. Say you have three kids and you know, they don't have them and you plan on spending $60 for them for Christmas. What a great one gift an Instapot. It makes their life easier. And I just think it's a great gift. Okay. So that's what I'm going to be getting from Kroger this week. I will get some Denny Moore beef stew, some home Hormel chili. I'm going to do my milks. I'm going to get some Quaker granola bars and I'm going to get an Instapot. And I'm also going to buy some chicken thighs. Now they also have a digital that will come out tomorrow and it's four times fuel points on pet supplies. So yes, I will be doing the pet product four times fuel digitals. I'm going through a lot of dog food right now. Not as much as you would think having two great names and a great Pyrenees, <laughs> but
but it is enough that there is a significant difference. And in order to, um, in order to keep everyone healthy, I am making decisions to feed everybody the same. Yes, he is a puppy, but yes, he gets vitamins. Yes, they are older adults. And yes, they do get their salmon um, supplement. So everybody's getting supplements. Everybody's getting good, nutritious, raw vegetables, fruits, vegetables, meats. I've got, um, right now I've got some cow liver I need to cut up and, and cook for them. So I'm going to do that. Everybody's going to get some liver today. There you go. So the four times fuel point digital do that. If you get your dog food, cat food or whatever at Kroger, of course, they're going to tell you what you can use it on and what you can't. Okay. So let's talk about dollar general for a second. Um, there is a five off of 15 for the all snuggle Purex and Persil. I am going to try to do a deal today when I go up there and see if I can do that. I will show you, um, what the results are for that. My three off of my next purchase is gone. So I don't know where it went. I don't know. I, I really don't know where it went. <laughs> there is also a $5 instant on your Arm & Hammer detergents, which could make a really good deal with them with that, with your digital coupons. So I might even do an Arm & Hammer deal. Something I want to talk about are socks. 90% uh, off Gray Diamond and green, green Star socks right now. That means if they were $5, they're going to be $0.50. Cents. If they were a dollar, it's going to be $0.10. Cents. So what a great time to grab these socks up before the winter socks come in. Um, stocking stuffers make a box of socks to send to your grandbabies, whatever. What a great time to do that. So socks, think about socks. And that's what I'm going to look at when I go up to town here in a little while. I've got so much to do here today. I hope you all are staying busy. Even though it's a rainy, drizzly day, I am going to go in and clean in interiors of barns and coops today. That's my goal and get fresh straw out. I got to call and order hay. I've already talked to my surveyor last night. We're going to have this property surveyed. I don't know how much that's going to cost, but we've got to get it done. The neighbor and I are not going to be getting along with this fence situation. He wants me to put it three feet into my property, but he wants to maintain that three foot. I talked to the surveyor. He was like, oh God, no. He was like, please don't do that. <laughs> I was like, well, and he's like, no, 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 no. And I, and I did mention, isn't there something where if they have maintained it for so many years that it's actually a part of their property? And he was like, yeah, kind of the wording is a little different, but yeah, don't do that. <laughs> so now I've got to rethink everything. And it will probably go on my property line and he cannot contest a fence. So there you go. We're going to have some neighbor drama. <laughs> It'd be like the neighbor wars. Do you ever watch that show? Oh my gosh. Crazy. Like fear thy neighbor and the neighbor wars, neighborhood wars or whatever the hell it is. Oh my goodness. These people are nuts. Maybe I'm going to be one of them people. I don't know. Y'all have a great day. Hugs from a distance. If I do something at Dollar General today, I will show you what I've got, how much I saved. And maybe you can figure out something to get what you need. I really need, I really want to get my laundry detergent stuff stocked up because my husband uses way too much when he does his laundry, whether it's I mean, he went through all of my vinegar. I bet I had, I don't know how many gallons of vinegar down there in the past two years. He has, he went through all of it for his laundry. I told him just a little bit, but I think the crystals, the shaky things, I mean, concentrated laundry detergent to him is no different than laundry detergent that he used 20 years ago. I can't get it through his head, but his clothes are clean. Y'all have a great day. Hugs from a distance. Bye, y'all.